Okay, in this video we're going to do an air filter on a Toyota Coaster HBZ50, part number A340. So air filter there, a few cobwebs, Ryko A340, when it was made, it's been sitting but it is new, so let's pop it in. Okay, air filter located right here it's our air filter so to get it out we have one two and a third one around here you can just feel for let's have a look and see what the condition of the current one is that's a tough one to get So this is our current one, it's not too bad, it's a bit of dust there, but that's normal, it's fairly clean there, that could use a little bit of a wash out. So this is different to most cars because it's upside down, a little bit of dirt there. So the way this works is uh, the air comes in, comes into here, gets filtered and then goes into the motor. Here's our plate. Yeah, looking at that, it's just dusty. Let's see how clean and white it is there. Give it a bit of a wipe down in there with a wet cloth, but I uh, don't think we need to change that. There's nothing really there. Okay, so here's our filter. Holding it with one hand, putting the plate back on. Making sure it's seated on both sides with the gasket. Tightening it up. A little bit hard to hold up there, but... sure this doesn't cross thread. Make sure it goes on there nice and squarely. Keeps wanting to cross thread. That feels better. There we go. It's a big butterfly nut loosening off, making sure it's seated both sides well. Tight up tight so we squeeze all the all the washers together. Now there's three these back. I gave it a quick uh, clean up to make it look better. Make sure it's sitting in there nicely. Okay, that one's underneath. Okay, that one's in. Do the hard ones first, and finally the last one. And there's our uh, filter number as well if we wanted it. That's a little drain hole there, so if it gets water in there, it just kind of leaks out. I gave it a quick uh, clean up, as you can see, it makes it look a lot better. Thanks for watching.